Hello everybody, it's Agony333 and we're back for some more Crypt of the Serpent King. So, not gonna lie guys, I've been getting my ass kicked in level 2. I tried recording it already before. But yeah, these, the things in this level are whooping the shit out of me. But, I decided to try something different. I didn't want to, but I went ahead and bought the mace. Now why did I do that? Because look here, the range. 2.5, 2.8. I think this extra range may be what we need to tackle the adversaries in this fucking level. So yeah, I bought that. We're gonna try it out. Level 2 on Hardcore, let's fucking do this shit. So yeah guys, um, like I said, I've already tried recording this. And I've been decimated. But yeah, so here's level 2, we are in the sewers. And the enemy in this area is an asshole, the worst kind of asshole. Uh, it's a goblin, it has a very wide uh, hit. So it can fuck you up really quickly. But I'm hoping this extra reach may be what we need here to uh, take the fuck care of it. But yeah, basically, it's funny, I was mentioning, I think, last time how bullshit this level's gonna be. Basically, unlike most games, you know, where later stages are the worst. This game... Oh shit, okay. This game... Basically has it where level 2 is like the hardest level in the game, pretty much. I'm not even shitting you guys, like... Pretty much, we're gonna have ourselves a hell of a fucking bad time. But alright. Okay, god damn it. Yeah, and also, it's going to be kind of a little bit difficult to talk with these goblin fucks because, yeah, you got to have some uh, concentration in a sense. But I really didn't want to spend the gold on this mace, but like I said, I think that reach is going to help us. I'm hoping it is. Because other uh, things advise against doing that, and I was hoping to just save up for the sword, but... but you want as much reach as you can to step the fuck back. And as you can tell, well, as you can't tell because the other footage is gone... When I first tried this level with the hatchet, it takes four swings to kill one. Whereas now with this mace, it takes only three. But yeah, so it's going to prolong us getting the sword, but might make this level slightly easier, is my hope. Because yeah, these guys can hit far. They can hit fucking far. So you need to step the fuck back quickly. And at least I noticed with uh, playing with this mace... That it gives you just that little bit of extra space to make it a little easier to dodge them. Because that's what you want. You want to be able to dodge them quickly. And knock them the fuck down like I'm doing. And I'm doing okay so far, but we haven't even found a key yet. We got nine as well, I forgot to mention that. Instead of eight, there's fucking nine keys. Which is fucking awesome. I'm being sarcastic. Because, I mean, eight keys was enough of a scavenger hunt in itself, but now we have more of a fucking scavenger hunt with, with these goddamn goblins. I mean, I wouldn't mind as much if it wasn't for the fucking goblins, but... Yeah, basically, the goblin is the hardest enemy in the game, in my opinion, and I believe others have the same goddamn opinion. I don't know what's up their ass, but something is very much up their ass. Because they're on a fucking manhunt here. They, like, really want our balls badly. They really do. Come on. And there we go. Thank God. Okay, I'm doing okay. I'm just hoping I keep this streak about me. Because, yeah, I don't want to have to keep redoing this. Because, yeah, dude, I... The last recording, I pretty much... I think I spent 40 fucking minutes. 40 minutes of, of, of grinding and losing repeatedly. And yeah, since we're playing on Hardcore, pretty much the... You know, if you take one goddamn hit, it'll fuck you big time. And another thing I think I mentioned slightly is you want to watch these doorways. See? Okay, there's one. Hopefully just the one, and there's not another one down that way, but... You want to do one at a time. If you have more than one at a time, you're going to get screwed even heavier. Yeah, I went with this mace for the reach. Okay, good. So he's done. He's down for the count. Let's get this goddamn key. So we're one-third of the way. I've made it there before. I think I made it up to six on my other playthrough. Where I was really trying and just... Oh, man, I was about to rip my fucking hair out straight up. And I've played, like, the old Castlevanias. I've beaten the old Castlevanias. There's a dickhead down the hall. Yeah, let's bring him about. Hopefully another one didn't come again. 
Because, yeah, we want them one at a time. And I and I also seen things. Dick. You're an asshole. Damn it! Okay, I knew I was going to get hit that time. I knew. I, I moved forward just too much. Slightly too much that time. Fuck. Okay, but it's one hit. Let's see if we can fucking manage it. Who gives a shit? One stupid hit. Goddamn stupid fucking nitpicking bastard. Yeah, they, they love to they love to just nick the shit out of you. That's what they like to fucking do. And I'm worried because, yeah, I think I see one down there. If there's one down here, they might both come. Are they both coming? I don't know if the other one's coming or not. I know the one is. I think the other one's not because I think I va vaguely see it. Yeah, but it looks like the mace is making it slightly easier. At least in my opinion, it's making it slightly fucking easier. But basically, once we've made it out of this stretch, this fucking level, uh, it'll be a little bit easier all the way through, in my opinion, at least from what I've seen of what I've played. And yeah, I already got that key. What am I doing? Uh, yeah, I, I was trying to think if I had gotten that key or not, which I already have. But yeah, you want to wait till they swing first. And then strike. So you want to try to pry, like, kind of provoke them to swing. And then back the fuck up quickly. Good, okay, wait. Okay, so this is the actual boss over here, guys. And yeah, it's it's also, in my opinion, one of the hardest bosses. Because look how confined this space is. We gotta fight this goddamn little midget fuck. Uh, goblin piece of crap in this fucking little confined area. But we need all the keys first. And yeah, we have twisting paths and shit. Okay, so we're okay so far. Let me see something. I want to see if there's a goblin down here. Okay, there's another key. Okay, that's awesome as fuck. We're doing pretty fucking good this time. Already at five. Whew! And yeah, like I said, the, the nerve-wracking is it's here for me. Another thing is you can use these flames to your advantage a little bit. And uh, have a goblin, like, wander the fuck into the flame. And the flame will do a little bit of damage to them. Yeah, so we're two-thirds of the way now. I'm really hoping I don't fucking commit suicide. Okay, there's nothing down there so far. Another key. Awesome shit. This is the furthest I've made it so far, guys. On hardcore. Because, like I said, the other time I recorded, I think I made it to six. So it's coming along nicely. That's I'm thankful as fuck, but let's see if we can finish it up. But I'm hoping we can finish it up. Yeah, it just connects to there. I like filling in bits of the map when I can, too. And so far, we haven't met a, a dastardly bitch for quite a while now. But whatever. We haven't actually even gotten much gold, either. But the thing I'm going to have to watch out for, I think I mentioned last time, that got cut is um, sometimes enemies will respawn. It's very rare, but I've noticed it a few times where an enemy will respawn. There you are, you fucking prick. I knew it. I had to come sometime. Smack, smack. Smack, smack. Mushroom stamp your fucking face. Oh, what? Okay, he had an extra swing there. I don't know why, because usually three does it, but you're a fucking prick. I'm, I'm not going to take that loss. I'm going to be confident and fine. You guys don't have me. Shit, okay, one of them was triggered, I think. Only one, thank God. Yeah, the thing I'm worried about is the confined nature of the, uh... The boss chambers is a bitch. Okay, yeah. Now let's trigger the other asshole. Because I want that chest over there, because we need to get gold back for the sword. Because, yeah, we do want the sword still. Just, the mace was just to help with this level, pretty much. Because the next level ain't a problem. It's just this one is in the way. At least I don't find the next level to be a problem. Maybe there's other people who do, but uh, personally, I do not. I do not find the next level all that bad. But maybe it'll vamp up in hardcore. Who fucking knows? We're one key away, guys. I'm feeling great. Just need to find that last key. But I will probably also uh, go back and see if there's any chests. So even if there's some extra area that uh, I have not explored, I'll probably go back to it. Because we want as much XP and uh, chests as we can get. 
fucking goddamn goblins. See, that was four. See, I hit him three times. That took a fourth. That's weird. I don't know why. I, I wonder if the second swing that I do... If you notice, you do two swings. I wonder if uh, that second swing didn't hit him or something. Okay, but there's the last fucking key, and I'm happier than fuck. But we gotta make it out of here, though, too, and hope that we can fight the boss. So we got all the keys. We don't have to deal with those fire traps anymore. We just need to make it through the peons now and get whatever chests we can get. But I think we are actually sort of coming to an end here. Which is great. It's like I said, once this level's over, I'll feel a lot better. Fuck off in your fucking ugly ass face. You... See, now it's taking four shots again. I wonder if... Did you see it? Like, watch the swing. One, two, yeah. I wonder if a couple of those extra swings I must not be doing... There we go. Oh, God damn it! I hate these fuckers so much. I hate them so fucking much. Oh, I thought I was going to get nicked there again. I so thought I was going to get nicked. But I got lucky. And we're getting some gold back. That's fucking splendid. Absolutely fantastic. But I'm going to pop in the map real quick. Okay, so yeah, guys, we've pretty much explored everything but just down uh, this way. So I'm going to go do that real quick, because there might be some extra chests we want there. <clears throat> and uh, there shouldn't be any enemies, but like I said, it's rare there will be the occasional fucking enemy. But so far, I would say personally that the mace does help. Because like I said, other things, I was kind of trying to look up some tips and tricks type deal. And, uh, other things advised against spending any money on the mace. But I feel like it is a little bit easier to dodge them. Alright, so yeah, we are done, guys. I believe we've covered every inch of this fucking godforsaken place. We just gotta hope now that I can manage the boss. And boy, do I hope the fuck I can. Because he, he's a little bastard. And it's mainly just because you're confined to this small space. But here we go. Goblin fucker. On. Oh my god. Oh my god. On. Got him. Oh my god. That was so close, but I fucking did it, guys. Oh my god. Yes. You do not know my pain. You guys do not know my pain. It was only 12 minutes. Thank you fucking Christ. I'm so happy because, yeah, like I told you guys, I tried that over and over with the hatchet, and I was just... I was wanting to smash my fucking forehead into a wall and just jump off a fucking cliff and just... Yeah, fuck my life completely. But nope, I finally did it. I finally got through those bastards. I recommend the mace. It makes backstepping a little bit easier just because of the extra reach. So I would totally say do it. But yeah, we did this. Got some golden stuff. And here comes my trophy, right? Yep, level two on hard. Sweet, I got the trophy. I, I know it probably ain't shown for you guys. I never enabled it, so. But anyways, yeah, we beat level two on hardcore. Um, we got some good XP here, too, so. I found that people have recommended going with agility, so that's what I'm going to do. Because I'm going to go as far with agility as I can. And we're just going to stick with the mace, because now what we want to do is we want to save up for this fucking sword. So once we get that sword, we're going to be dominating like hell. But I'm going to keep the mace out. And yeah, so we fucking did it, folks. We fucking curb stomped the shit out of those fucking goblins. They ain't got shit on us, and we're never going to see those ugly motherfuckers ever again. Like I said, I don't know what was up their ass, but something was giving them a bad fucking day. But I don't give a fuck. Bye-bye, bitches. We're on to level three. So yeah, guys, I am done. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope you liked, you know, me actually succeeding. Like I said, I kind of wish now you could have seen me fail so many times because you probably had a good laugh with me, but oh my god, it was it was just horrible. But we fucking did it. So if you like uh, Crypt of the Serpent King, like, comment, subscribe for more. If you like my stupid uh, rantings or, you know, monologue, dialogue, whatever you want to call it, like, comment, subscribe for more, and we'll be back for level fucking three. In my opinion, anyways, the, the road's going to get a little bit easier. Hopefully that's the case. I don't know if Hardcore makes it 
any much harder, but at least for me, level two is the worst of it, so. But all right, guys, this has been Agony333, and I'm signing out, everybody. Have yourself a fucking great one. Peace out, everybody.